Guys, I figured out the, the best way. Needle nose, angled pliers, and a little bit of luck. Alright, I'm gonna put the camera right here. I did a video before with my holding it with my chin. Maybe hope you guys could see this. So you can see that it's in there, right? Let's see. I can't see what I'm recording. But basically you do this, you wiggle a little bit. What I do is I put my finger in a little bit more. And all right, let me see, let it go, let me go. Grab it again. And it came in. It went in. What a pain in the ass this is. I can't believe this. So, I don't know, I don't know what I recorded, but... There it is. I just did it right now live. Live on tape, as they say. So I'm done with all four of these. I mean, um, all eight of these uh, mounts. So now, you know what I'm going to do? Let me pause this for a second. I'm going to reposition the fans and I'm going to put them right in there. How they're supposed to go. Hold on one second. And then I'll do that. Uh, I'll mount them into the case when they're in there okay this was a little bit harder than I thought it was I had to move the the wire my uh, 12 volt CPU power wire which is right there on the bottom in the between the fan and the heatsink on in the video as you can see so once they're in there you just pull them through hold on a second let me move some of this crap over here Uh, I'm going to put the camera here. I'm having a tripod, so you guys hopefully can still see this. Let me move this, these screwdrivers over. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Oh. All right, so, because I need two hands to hold, to do this, hold the fan and, and pull this through, so. Once they're in there, you just pull it through like this. Well, I could do this with hands, I think. Yeah, that's easy. The fans, the, the, the case side is easy. There it is. They're in there now. And I'll do the top one. Uh, one second. See, you could see the top one like this. Let me do it with holding one hand hold on where's the grip all right hold on a second so there it is it's out of focus but oh well I'm going to show you right here is it in it's not in oh crap I need to I need to I need two hands Alright, that's in. And that's in. Okay. So now, now the fan is mounted. Now all I gotta do is cut off these ends here. So I could put the filter. There's a filter that goes over here. Uh, yeah. Unless I, unless I could somehow squeeze it in there. Alright, I'm not gonna worry about it right now. But uh, that's how it is. And I'm going to do the second one the same way. And then I'll trim off the, the ends and put the fan on. I like, I like it now. It's, it's totally isolated from the case. There's a little bit of room, a little bit of space here. But you know what? I don't care about that. And then I'm going to take off the, this fan in here. There's two two screws on the bottom of the heatsink. There's two screws. Let me see. Let me show you guys. Uh, hold on. Uh, look at all the mess here. I got here. Where's my screwdriver here? All right. 
there's two screws right here I don't know if you can see them there's one right here the golden ones come on focus oh man I pushed the AF button by mistake now it's gonna focus all right so right here is one Let me move the camera over a little bit and here's the other screw right there so I'm going to take that off this uh, is an all copper heatsink heat pipes it doesn't need that fan on there I originally was going to have it blowing out but I don't need it I figure I try it without the, the fan in it and it works fine without it and I'm going to hook up these fans the two case fans that go here to the CPU power uh, CPU fan uh, power connector alright so see you in the next video